previously on Baldur's Gate 3. Alright guys, let's just hope all those goblins that were on the other side originally are no longer there. Uh oh, that does not sound good. It's not good. Alright, so I decided to go back and retry getting the trolls on my side. Because I was not going to go and fight all those goblins. I tried, well, I tried, but that was not going anywhere. So I went back. Yes, and I got them on my side. All right, so we've gone and killed all the three leaders, the chosen ones, and I ended up finding this back room. Now, in the back room, there is a little puzzle that you do. There is the front section where you have the four squares, and then you have the blacked out parts on those squares you want to make sure you get all those four square circles with the black spot in the light it's really not that difficult just get a turn and turn them and you'll get it um but as you can see i'm currently going down this ladder into the under cave Suenite Outpost. Hmm. Save the game real quick. What is this place? Okay. Did I find a secret exit? Ooh, see. In here. I found a secret exit. Who the heck are you? Hard to say, for your journey is just beginning. What would suit the occasion? Hmm. The words to a lullaby, perhaps. The mouse smiled brightly. It outfoxed the cat. Then down came the claw. And that? Love. Was that? <laughs> they do know how to write them in Cormier, don't they? Well met. I am Wait a minute, didn't he kind of come in here like the lady did? At your service. Maybe he's that lady's boss? Charmed, I'm sure, in more ways than one. We should have a chat, you and I, but not here. This quaint little scene is decidedly too middle of nowhere for my tastes. Come. Oh god, flashbang. Wait, you can go away now. Let me see what I'm doing, please. Jesus. Okay, so where the hell did you take me? Of hope, where the tired come to rest, 
and the famished come to feed lavishly. Go on, partake, enjoy your supper. After all, it might just be your last. <laughs> Are you not entertained? Are you not entertained? Really, dude? Okay, so you guy that was in the painting on the wall. What's better than a devil you don't know? <laughs> a devil you do. Am I a friend? Potentially. An adversary? Conceivably. But a savior? That's for certain. Why would you help me? Because my compassion is boundless. I stride among the needy, giving comfort where I can. And you're in dire need. One skull, two tenants, and no solution in sight. I could fix it all like that. Yeah, you're mad. I think we can deal with you. Is madness, but a denial of reality. Still, I have a feeling you'll change your mind before it's changed for you. Try to cure yourself. Shop around. Beg, borrow, and steal. Exhaust every possibility until none are left. And when hope has been whittled down to the very marrow of despair. That's when you'll come knocking on my door. Hope. <laughs> Such a tease. Okay, can you just let me go? If I want to do the deal, how would I do it? Watching you squirm like a tadpole through a nice juicy brain. Okay, dude. All those pretty little symptoms, sundering skin, dissolving guts, they haven't manifested yet, have they? One might say you're a paragon of luck. I'll be there when it runs out. So, okay, th thank God I'm back where I was. So you just want to use me, okay? Waypoint. Alright, before we head out, we're going to go ahead and save real quick. We'll do a new save. Yep. Oh, there he is. Reported. The goblin's leadership has been decimated. We might escape this place yet. And I hear you are the one to thank. I'm grateful. I took a collection from all of us. It isn't much, but you've earned it. Thank you. It's not enough, but it's all we have. Hal Sin will likely want to thank you too, mind. He returned just a while ago. I believe he's catching up with Corker. As for us... No armies at our heels. Amazing. We can finally leave. But perhaps we need not speak of farewells. We'll join your camp tonight to celebrate if you'll have us. Yeah, come on. Oh, it's you. My condition is worsening again. I need to consume some powerful magic or it may become volatile. All right, what do we got?
I'm gonna give you this one. Thank you. Strange experience. Each time anew, I come. Lost soul is spelunking through the darkness that is me, only to be sacrificed on the dread altar of the heart. But this doesn't feel quite right. I mean, it never feels right, but it relieves. This doesn't relieve. Oh. Mm. Uh, what is happening? The magic isn't having the effect it should have. It's not like the last time, like a rainstorm that quells a forest fire and merely drizzles. The embers still sizzle. The fire remains undefeated. Oh, do you need more? Going on, but nothing good. Please, I need to think. I need to retrace my steps to a glade of calm and think. Thank you for the artifact. A great deal of trouble it was too. A great deal of trouble indeed. You took it upon yourself to undertake the right of thorns. I ought to exile you from this place forever. Instead, I shall listen to the explanation that you owe me. I owe you nothing. Goblins swarmed us like roaches while you stumbled after the past. You chose to abandon us. I chose to protect us. Silence. The right has been ended. I will allow you to stay, but consider yourself a novice anew. You have forgotten the ways of the druids, our place in the natural order. You shall learn it all once again right here. Backslide, and nature's fury will crush you. As you wish, Master Halcyon. That's all she tried to prison her child, you know, hands full with her. It's a great spirit. Be harsh. Mmm. Yeah, my hands she full of her. Insolent, but time will humble her. And the grove still needs her. Mm-hmm. You will soon see why. But enough of that for now. I owe you my thanks. The grove stands. Nature prevails. And again, I am in your debt. Speak to Wrath. He will reward you for your efforts. Yeah, you know, but my problem. We shall discuss what is to come. Okay, sweet. You've done it. You brought Halcyn back. Thank you. No, thanks is not enough. May Sylvanus bless you for all your days. I cannot imagine taking on a camp full of goblins was a simple task. Yeah, I think not really safe. The grove will be whole again. Let me show you on your map where you can find the cash. Take this rune. You'll need it. Place it among the pedestals inside our library. When the wolf glows brightest, everything in the vault below will be yours. Ooh, okay. as flattered as I do. Invited to dine with a devil. <laughs> Believe me, that was a devil's equivalent of serenades and roses. Don't let his bluster fool you. All that talk of desperation merely illustrates his own. I think he wants something from us. Badly. And in that knowledge lies our opportunity.
our souls. But I suspect that's but his opening offer. Let me play the devil's advocate. The man is too eager. Do not dismiss his offer out of hand. If there's one quality hmm. of all the denizens of the hells embody, it's ambition. A quality they share with many humans, come to think of it. What do you think of Raphael's ambition could be? I'm the foggiest. But, based on the evidence before us, we can make certain deductions as to why he sought out our merry band. Fact one, there's something very strange and very powerful about our tadpoles. True. Fact two, a devil offers to take it away. Devils aren't known to aid mortals out of simple kindness. Whatever Raphael wants, we must be the key to getting it. And they were fighting the uh the Thus in the beginning, so I mean who knows. Raphael will seek us out again, and when he does, there's a mighty bargain to be made. Remember his Cormirian Ryan? Down came the claw. Perhaps we should start growing our nails. But not too bad. All right, it's time to go down and get our prize. Now he did say everything down here is for us. What's inside? That's what we got here. Poison, resistance, vitamin toxin, antidote. Take that. Ooh, so Read it. I'd rather take it. Ooh, potion of animal speaking. Game ability to comprehend verbally for your next long rest. That'd be great. What's a beast not to attack you? Nice. Aura. Is that it? Really? Really? That's all you're gonna give me? We're ready to head to your camp. Are you? Go there. Excellent. Lead the way. Is up here under the stars. It's a bed and a roof for me. But off you go, Master Ranger. Without you. You came through for us. That's a change from most adults I know. And that sounds like the wine drowning your wits. <laughs> enjoy yourself. I've squirreled away a few extra bottles. With the barrels tapped out, I'll be there to save the night. For a price, of course. no idea how good it feels to see these people smiling the singing we could probably do without but even mm -hmm. so thank you yeah no problem Come on, Alfie, make it spicy. hope you're enjoying the night hero i certainly am 
Cheers to many more like this. Go on, do your rounds. But if they hand you something purple, don't drink it. I think they got into Ethel's potions. Uh oh. <laughs> Go on, do your rounds. But if. All right, let's see. Everyone seems to be in high spirits. Strange. You know who I never thought I'd find myself caring for? Me? Your words, not mine. But not what I mean. I mean, desperate people. Oh, yeah. Like those refugees. Never gave them much thought. Certainly not that bunch in the grove. Yet we came through for them. We saved their lives. We did. Odd. Something like that. I was taught to reject anything that distracted from Shah. Mm. There'll be time for penance later. Share a bottle with me? Yeah. We should wait a little while. Until the others have drifted off. Best not keep me waiting. I'd prefer not to entertain myself. Nearly light. The others will be awake soon. Another moment won't kill them, I suppose. Well, it might, but let's take that risk. Thank you for last night. Me too. She trails off. You read an invitation in her eyes. That didn't hurt, did it? Good to know. For the future. Let's head back. If we must. <sighs> I trust you enjoyed your evening. After all your efforts, it was well deserved. It may be some time before you're afforded another such night. There is much to be done, and I promised I would help you however I could. I'm certain a cure for you can be found at Moonrise Towers, but it's complicated. The journey specifically, it's extremely perilous, though it seems you're well accustomed to navigating danger. To get to the towers, You'll need to pass through a terrible place. A cursed place. This curse shrouds everything in shadow. You will not find life, light, or anything natural there. Any who linger are twisted by the curse. They become shadow beings. Tormented. Dangerous souls. You're half right. You have to get to Moonrise. But you still have a choice of how to get there. Okay. You could go overland, along the Risen Road, or through the mountains. Easier at first, but you'll run into the Shadow Curse eventually. You could also go under. There is a tunnel somewhere in the ruined Temple of Saluna. It leads to Moonrise Towers through the Underdark. Long ago, a man called Keterik Thorm built a secret stronghold deep down there. 
before rallying a whole army of Dark Justicius, Shah worshippers. Dark Justicius? I must see for myself. Aridan and his lot were looking for a way down there. They were promised riches if they retrieved a relic called the Night Song. But I think there's more. From this story, well, I think that's probably where I ended up going. Could access both the Temple of Saluna and Moonrise Towers. But he was defeated before he could launch an attack. If you can find this place, I'll wager it will reveal a more direct path to Moonrise Towers. And maybe even bypass the worst of the Shadow Curse. Yeah, I already found it. <laughs> if only I'd gone with you instead of Aradin. I would like to join your camp, if you'll allow me. I can offer my skills, my ah, counsel. Son of a bitch. I've long sought to return to Moonrise Towers. It seems our fates have aligned. Let's go then. May Sylvanas guide us. All right, back into Silenite Outpost. Let's see if we can find the pathway to the Moonrise Tower and see if we can find the Night Song. Oh, I didn't make a click on you. What, what was that? Oh, shoot. What the heck? Is that a minotaur? Oh, boy. This is going to be the start of a new adventure. Hopefully you guys enjoyed this video. If you did, make sure you like, subscribe, and comment down below. And stay tuned guys. For this next adventure, it'll be a doozy.